going to jump right into it. Um, this is a highly requested video, so I'm going to be showing you guys this video without me speeding it up. So just go ahead and comb your brow hairs going up. Then today I'm using my stud eyebrows by Ma Ma MAC Cosmetics. And the trick to my brows is I actually start off in the middle and I do very light strokes as you can see. I actually trace my brows pretty much to where my natural hair ends. So I don't go overboard and try to make my own brows. It's literally the height of my natural brows, as you can see. So after I just lightly trace the outside, I brush my hairs right back up and then fill in, fill in any spots that seem like they're a little bit bare. And that's pretty much it for that. Then I go in with my e.l.f. brow and gel, brow, e.l.f. brow and gel elf brow and eyelash gel and I just brush my brows going upward this basically just keeps them into place then I'm going in with my LA girl concealer and the color font and you need very little to clean up your brows you don't need a lot then using this angle brush I know I got this as a gift but it's from Target um, I just lightly go in and take your time if you're not used to doing your own brows I find that light strokes are better than just trying to trace all at once. So even me who does my brows like all the time, I still take my time in doing my brows. So just do small strokes and as you can see I never put the brush exactly flat until everything's already traced. Then I use my brush kind of just to blend everything out. And as you can see, I use very little concealer and that's the best when it comes to actually trying to blend out your concealer after. So after you achieve whatever perfect line you want, whatever is left on that brush, you just use it to clean up the tail of your brows. So as you can see, there's not much concealer left. I'm just kind of trying to take from, from the bottom to just clean up that top. But I never trace my whole eyebrow I do not do that so just go ahead and clean up that tip until you get the desired shape that you want I like mine to be kind of pointed at the end but that's my preference then using my finger I prefer to use my finger to blend out concealer just because it warms the concealer up it makes it a lot easier to blend so just take your time with this because you don't want to ruin your brows and um, yeah, just use your ring finger to blend out that concealer. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and follow me on Instagram at I am Linda and Snapchat at Your Mexican Beauty. I'll see you lovelies next week.